Welcome back. So far we have covered set, subset and power set. Now let's look into the Venn diagrams and operations on sets. Venn diagrams make it easy to understand set operations like union, intersection and so on. It's basically a schematic representation of a set. We use a circle for a set and a rectangle for universal set. And shaded region are the elements. We shall use these diagrams in set operations. So let's start. For a clear understanding, let's take some example sets. Universal set U, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And A, a subset of U, 1, 2, 3, B, 3, 4. So let's first represent the universal set with a rectangle, then A, which is a subset, and it has 1, 2, 3, and B has 3, 4. This 3 is a common element of A and B. But 5 is missing in both. So let's write it outside. This is a pictorial representation of these sets. The first operation we're going to perform on this is union, which says that A union B is the set of all elements of set A as well as set B. In predicate notation, we can write it like this. A union B is X such that X belongs to A or X belongs to B. And the Venn diagram would be something like this. All elements of A and B, so it's 1, 2, 3 and 4. Intersection. A intersection B is a set of elements which belong to both A and B. That's nothing but the uh, common elements. So A intersection B is X such that X belongs to A as well as X belongs to B. Here's the Venn diagram. Here the common element is 3. Now what if there is no common element? That's A intersection B is null. Then these sets A and B are called disjoint set. Set difference. Few authors write it as A by B and few A minus B. I'll use A minus B. A minus B is a set with elements of A that are not in B. So A minus B is X such that X belongs to A and X does not belong to B. And the Venn diagram. So A minus B is just one and two. Three is the common element, so we have just discarded that. Complement. A complement it's a set with elements that are not in A. So basically it's uh, removing the elements of A from the universal set. So we can think A complement as U minus A. That's X such that X belongs to U and X does not belong to A. So here A complement will be 4 and 5. Symmetric difference, A delta B. It's a set with elements of A or B, but not both. That's X such that X belongs to A or X belongs to B. And X does not belong to A and B. So it's like from A and B together, we just need to remove the common elements. So here the common element is 3. So A delta B will be 1, 2 and 4. So these are the basic set operations. When we have two sets A and B, using any of the operations like union, intersection, difference, uh, complement or when symmetric difference, we get a new set of elements. There's one more set operation called Cartesian product or simply product where the output is a set of ordered pairs. So before we jump into the product, let's first learn about the ordered pair. 
An ordered pair is a group of two elements wrapped in a bracket. Like two comma three, five comma eight, etc. These are very similar to the coordinates on graphs x, y, and these are called ordered pairs because uh, they follow an order. Two comma three is not equivalent to three comma two. They are different. Cartesian product a cross b. Let's take a set a one two three b is a b. Now a cross b is we need to pair up each element of a with each element of b so 1 comma a 1 comma b 2 comma a 2 comma b 3 comma a 3 comma b now if i have to define this we can say it like this it is a set of all ordered pairs such that first member of the ordered pair is from set a and the second is from the set b so a cross b is x comma y such that x belongs to a and y belongs to b what do you think uh, will be the cardinality of this kind of a set look here a is three elements b has two elements so a cross b is 3 into 2 6 so the cardinality of a cross b is, is basically number of elements of a multiplied by number of elements of b so mod of a cross b is mod a into mod b Wrapping it up, union is basically set of all elements of A and B. Intersection is common elements of A and B. Difference is elements of A without B. Complement is elements that are not in A. And symmetric difference is elements in A or B but not in both. Cross product is a pair of elements of A and B.